So this US Love Islander has now just been exposed and people are really upset about it and discussing it everywhere. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. Back at again with another video. If you haven't subscribed, guys, click that button for daily and consistent content. Head over to my Instagram at Murad underscore Morali. Subscribe to the channel. Click that button, guys. Subscribe and let's just get straight into this video. So I was alerted to this as well and people have been discussing this, but a Love Islander from US Love Island has been exposed for their old tweets for something that they had said and it's just not good at all. And the guy's name is Mike. So Mike, I believe, was a Casa Amor situation. He was heavily interested in Kirsten and Justine. And um, somebody tweeted saying, my sister graduated from kindergarten today. She's been talking about this little boy all year. Guess that's her boyfriend. And then, of course, he responded saying, cute, but honestly, my finna grow up and forget all about her and fall in love for a Hispanic girl and she's gonna ruin his life. Hashtag light skin probs. This was made in 2017, so perhaps, you know, three years ago, which isn't that long ago, but people are really irritated saying, you know, wow, production didn't do a very good job at checking social media before they let these people on the show. Um, it's, it's just interesting how we've had, yeah, before I'll, I'll get into that later. Um, but again, he says, um, and she's gonna ruin his life, hashtag light skin props. Now, maybe he, I'm giving somebody the benefit of the doubt because I just, I'm a, I feel like I'm, I'm just a good person and I just want someone to feel like maybe they didn't mean it in this way. Most likely they did, but perhaps he was um, reflecting on what light skin people may think as a, um, in terms of like a trend of what their problems would be and he's given an example. But at the same time, I highly doubt that would be it. Um, but I just feel like, yeah. It's interesting because, um, he said to Justine recently, you owe me a new phone to much heat in the pic, my screen shattered, send me the bill. Of course, you know, showing love for her and so forth. It's just funny how we've had just um, Mike and Trey, both have had tweets, you know, dug, basically digged up about them, the colorist related stuff, yet both of those people seem to be liking Justine in a way. And then it kind of, pop, you know, gives me the um, perception that perhaps people like Mike especially were, had a whole game plan of going for someone like Justine so that they could get some kind of praise. Do you know what I mean? Like maybe something of that could have been a, a theory. And, and I specifically mean this just for a show because the show is a game and people have a game plan. Um, but at the same time, maybe that tweet wasn't made. Maybe he was making fun of all people or showing what people th think. That could be, you know, one example, but at the same time, more time, he probably isn't. Um, he, he deleted the tweet as well. And people are talking about it on Reddit, on Twitter, um, just all over on Love Island social media forums. And they're not really surprised, but they are finding it irritating, especially because he did like Justine. So they were like, what if that actually took place? Imagine if they won the show together and this came out. That would have been even more worse. Let me know your thoughts, guys, when it comes to this. Subscribe to the channel. I'll catch you guys soon for another video.